the week of the 19th through the 25th of March is coming up. And for this week's Angel Guidance, we're having a special guest. We're connecting with Archangel Michael to receive his guidance for this upcoming week. So keep watching because Archangel Michael is already here waiting to give us his messages. Hello beautiful soul, my name is Maria and today we're receiving angel guidance directly from Archangel Michael for the week of the 19th through the 25th of March 2018. So if you're interested in improving your health and also growing your spirituality, remember to go to the subscribe button below so you will always get notifications whenever I post a new Reiki healing or a new angel guidance here in my channel. And this week, we're going to be using the Archangel Michael Oracle cards. This is also by the Ring Virtual. There are 44 cards in this deck. I already connected with his energy. He's already here with us. The cards are here. And he's just waiting to choose the right cards to give us the message. So as always, I ask you to close your eyes and connect with me. And just keep asking from your heart which messages Archangel Michael wants to give us for this week, what he wants to tell us, what does he want us to know, how is the energy. So let's keep shuffling and asking him for Monday and Tuesday, which card, which message is he going to give us. So let's just continue to shuffle until he asks me to stop, until he, the cards that he wants comes up and we can get the right message. So he's asking me to stay. Okay, it's here. So Monday and Tuesday is already here. So let's see now for Wednesday and Thursday. So again, I ask you to close your eyes and keep asking with me. Keep asking him, opening your heart. Remember, open your hearts to receive his guidance. Open your heart so he can get the right message for you because you are listening to this video for a reason. So there is something here that he wants you to know. He's asking me again to stop. So Monday and Tuesday is here. Sorry, Wednesday and Thursday. <laughs> and now for the weekend, for Friday, Saturday and Sunday, continuing again to ask for his guidance. Archangel Michael's energy is very strong. He's very kind. He's very powerful. He's always giving us a beautiful and encouraging messages. So let's continue to shuffle to see what he wants, what he wants us to know for the weekend. Let's see what he tells us. So continue to shuffle. He's asking me and he's smiling and saying, just move on. Keep going. The card is not here yet. So I will do. Okay. There you go. He chose it. <laughs> there you go. It's flying away. Let me just pick it up. Oh, he got two cards for the weekend. Beautiful. So let's see for Monday and Tuesday what our dear Archangel Michael is saying. So the card says, admit the truth to, to yourself and act accordingly. That's what the prayer says. I appreciate your support in helping me face my feelings with grace and acceptance so that I can be lovingly honest with myself and others. Thank you, Archangel Michael, for giving me courage and strength. It's such a beautiful message and Archangel Michael wants you to know that to begin your week in a positive vibration, feeling good about yourself, it's time to face your reality, my dear. Enough of hiding your feelings. Enough of pretending that everything in your life is 100% fine. When you face how you feel, when you admit how you feel, then you heal it. Then the feeling comes to surface and it's released. But if you block it, if you keep hiding it from yourself, if you keep telling yourself, no, I'm fine, everything is okay, there's nothing, I, there's nothing worrying me, nothing is bothering me, I'm strong like a rock. Wait, breathe, remember, 
you are a human being, you are supposed to be feeling. You're supposed to feel sad from time to time. You're supposed to feel low sometimes. It's okay. He wants you to know. He's telling me with a very kind energy to let you know that it is okay to feel in any way you feel. It's fine. Admit it. Allow yourself to feel anything that is going on inside of you. If someone hurts you before, feel it. Don't hide it. Don't pretend anymore that everything is fine. Allow the feeling to come out of you and be released so Archangel Michael can clear it for you. So he can step forward and he can release it. But if you don't allow it, if you block this feeling inside your heart, and you just live your life pretending it's not there, it's going to be hurting you. It's going to be keeping you down. It's going to stay there with you over and over again, hurting you from time to time. You will feel it. You will remember it and it's going to hurt you. So remember, my dear, that once you face it, once you acknowledge how you feel, once you tell yourself, okay, I do feel this way. I, 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 I allow this feeling to come up. I allow myself to feel like this. First, you're giving yourself permission to feel. Second, you're having compassion towards yourself. You're understanding yourself. You're allowing yourself to feel it. And when you feel it, it comes up. It might be hard, I know. I know it hurts. I know it's not easy. But when you feel it, it's out of you. It's released. You feel lighter. You feel like this is not inside of you anymore. So Archangel Michael is asking you to simply let go, my dear. Surrender. Surrender to his care. He wants so strongly to help you with this. So simply acknowledge how you feel by acknowledging how you feel. You're already telling yourself that this is real. This is inside of you and you're already releasing it. But if you keep telling yourself, if you keep telling the world that this is not happening, that you are strong, that nothing happened to you, nothing changed, nothing can touch you, then you will be vulnerable. Then you will be weak inside because you're holding it deep inside of you. You're allowing this negative feeling to create deep roots inside of you. And it's going to be stronger and stronger from time to time. The more you move forward, feeling this way and neglecting it, the harder it is, the heavier the feeling stays in you. So remember, my dear, begin your week doing this uh, thinking about what you need to let go. Surrender to Archangel Michael. He's here to tell you that he wants to help you. So ask him, invite him to your life. Invite him to come up and just take it out from you. Tell him, okay, I acknowledge, I know I'm feeling this and I don't want to feel this anymore. So please, Archangel Michael, take it out from me, release it, clear it so I can move on. Okay, my dear, this is the message for the beginning of the week. I can continue to talk about this topic for hours. So he's asking me, let's go move forward. So now Wednesday and Thursday, you and your loved ones are safe. Oh, it's a beautiful card. I love it. So the prayer is saying, Dear God and Archangel Michael, thank you for watching over me and my loved ones. Please help me feel secure and at peace. And fill me with faith so that I may focus on my priorities and enjoy a healthful and happy life. So this card is just a connection with the cards for Monday and Wednesday, for Monday and Tuesday. He's telling you that everything is fine. 
everyone is protected, the people you've been worrying about. If you ask Archangel Michael, he will be there and he will protect them. Everyone. He can be everywhere at the same time. His energy is very powerful, he's very strong. And when you allow him to work in your life, you will start to feel amazing changes. Because he's here, that's why he's here for. His energy is very strong, you can feel his presence very easily. So ask him to go to every single person that you love and protect this person. Because once you detach from these worries, then you can focus on you. Then you can focus on how you feel. Then you can surrender. Then you can feel happier. Then you can feel more peaceful. So enough of worrying. Trust Archangel Michael. Trust your angels. They will never allow anything bad to happen. As long as you ask them to do it. So allow it, ask him to step forward and guide you always. Ask him to step forward and be by the side of everyone that you love. And he will. He wants you to know that he will. He's just waiting for, your, for the invitation. <laughs> so remember, my dear, everything can be guided, can be protected in a beautiful way by him but you need to ask if you want to move on with your life without these worries that th there's no need to worry there's other things that you need to worry about but not about protection not about safety because when you ask Archangel Michael to be there he will and then you can think about something else you can focus about your feelings you can focus about releasing what's making you sad. Okay, so remember, my dear, King Joe Michael is here for you. And he wants you to know, he's telling me over and over, I am here. I'm waiting. Please call me. You need to understand that I'm here for you, my dear. Okay, so remember to call upon him for everyone in your life for yourself as well, to protect you, to guide you, to clear you, okay? So let's see now for the weekend, for Friday, Saturday and Sunday, remember he gave us two, two cards. The first one, <laughs> I, can't, I can't lie, <laughs> I can't pretend. Um, the card says, ask Archangel Michael to help you with this situation. <laughs> The prayer is, Archangel Michael, thank you for assisting me. Please help me be filled with faith and peace at all times. So this card is just confirming what I was talking to you before. You have to ask. He's waiting for your permission to work with you. So ask for him to come forward. There is no, you need to understand this. There is no right way to talk to your angels. There are no right words. There's no such thing as the right prayer that you follow this and these words and that you call upon him, calling him his highness. It's nothing like this. He is your friend. Your angels are your friends. You can talk to them as if you're talking to your very best friend. So he's telling you to ask for him to help you with anything you need. Call upon him and ask him to fill up your heart with faith, with knowing that he's there. Ask him to give you signs that he is taking over, that he is in your life now, that he's coming in and he's helping you. And he will. Archangel Michael is very prompt when we ask for his help. He's there even before you finished asking. So the message, the main message is to connect with him. That's why he wanted to do the guidance this week. Just to remind you that he is here for you and he wants to work with you. 
Okay, so the next card is about having confidence, a beautiful card. The prayer says, Archangel Michael, please lend me your courage and fortitude. Help me realize that I am one with all that is divine. Wisdom, strength, love, creativity, abundance and health. Allow me to feel confident and peaceful about myself in all ways. So my dear, to close up your weekend, Archangel Michael is giving you strength and courage. He wants you to remember that you are a being of light, that the divine lives within you, that you can achieve everything you want. You have all the health that you need, all the courage that you need, all the creativity that you need, all the wealth that you need. It lives inside of you. But if you forget yourself, if you forget this connection with your own soul and with the divine and all these beings of light around you, if you neglect this, then of course, of course, things are starting to go, uh, things are gonna start to go wrong. You're gonna start to lose control. So he wants to remind you that the more you connect with yourself, with your angels, the more courage you're gonna have to do the things you want, to change your life, to face those feelings that he was talking about. Remember, my dear, connect, breathe. When you go to your shower, close your eyes for a few seconds and simply allow yourself to connect with your breath. It is through your breath that you connect with your angels. It is to, through your breath that you connect with your higher self because you manage to raise your vibration when you breathe. When you consciously breathe, when you consciously bring light within you, so remember, my dear, use your weekend to connect with yourself so Archangel Michael can bring you the courage that you need. Because you are there, you're simply allowing him to take over. You're in this state of faith, of knowing that he's there. So remember, okay? Remember, he, if you ask, He's going to be there and He's going to give you the courage that you need to take every action, to say every word, to do everything that you need throughout your week, throughout your life, as long as you allow Him to step forward and be by your side. And this was your angel guidance for the week of the 19th through the 25th of March 2018. I hope you enjoyed it, beautiful So I know I spoke a little bit too much, <laughs> but I just say the words that he's asking me to tell you. And I hope it's resonating with your heart. I hope it helps you to move on with your week, feeling lighter, feeling more connected with him. I wish you a wonderful and a blessed week, always in the company of your angels. And as always, I will see you soon. Namaste.